The Volvo XC40 Recharge P8 All-Wheel Drive Luxury Compact SUV, the first of several fully electric Volvos to come. The XC40 Recharge is everything customers expect from a Volvo, with the addition of a state-of-the-art, fully electric all-wheel drive powertrain that offers a projected range of over 200 miles on a single charge. The all-wheel drive XC40 P8 Recharge features two 201 horsepower electric motors, one mounted on each axle, that combine to offer 402 horsepower, and 487 pounds-feet of torque. That enables it to achieve 0 to 62 miles per hour in 4.9 seconds, and a governed top speed of 112 miles per hour. The large, 78 kilowatt-hours battery can be fast charged to 80% of its capacity in approximately 40 minutes on a DC fast charger system of up to 150 kilowatts under optimal charging conditions. Tens of thousands of consumers have shown keen interest in the all-electric XC40, and the company already received several thousands of firm orders, even before the formal start of sales, and while order books remain open, every car scheduled to be built this calendar year has already been sold. The start of customer car production follows a period of preparation in which the Ghent plant has built a limited number of pre-production cars. This process, standard procedure for every new model, aims to optimize the production flow and ensure top-notch quality of every car built. All relevant production staff has also received extensive training on safely building electric cars. The new Android-powered infotainment system offers customers unprecedented personalization, improved levels of intuitiveness and embedded Google technology and services, such as the Google Assistant, Google Maps and the Google Play Store. The XC40 Recharge also receives larger software and operating system updates over the air. While building on the excellent safety standards of the original XC40, Volvo Cars safety engineers have completely redesigned and reinforced the frontal structure to address the absence of an engine, meet Volvo's high safety requirements, and help keep people as safe as in any other Volvo. The battery pack is protected by a safety cage embedded in the middle of the car's body structure. Its placement in the floor of the car also lowers the center of gravity of the car for better protection against rollovers. Inside, an innovative approach to all-round functionality gives drivers plenty of storage space, for example in the doors and in the trunk. Because it has no internal combustion engine, the car gives drivers even more storage space via a so-called frunk under the front hood. The vehicle largely retains the exterior and interior styling of the conventional XC40, albeit with the addition of a new sealed fascia in place of the traditional radiator grille for the combustion engine. The model also gets recharge branding and other minor design tweaks, while the charging port is located on the rear pillar of the car in the same place as a traditional petrol cap.
Built on the same compact modular architecture platform as the regular XC40, the recharge version retains largely the same dimensions with a length of 174 inches and a width of 80 inches. Because of the underfloor batteries, the XC40 recharge has a slightly reduced ground clearance of 6.9 inch compared with 8.3 inch on the regular model. The XC40 recharge offers 413 liters of luggage capacity, which is less than the 460 liters of the regular model, although due to the space saved by the absence of a combustion engine, it gains a 31-liter front storage area underneath the bonnet. The machine weighs a minimum of 4740 pounds, compared with 3300 pounds for the combustion engine version. The initial price of the XC40 recharge is similar to that of the closely related second-generation Polestar, the first purely electric model from Volvo's spin-off performance brand. That model, which features the same electric powertrain, an identical power, torque output and range, cost $65,000 in its initial launch edition. Planned base models are likely to cost around $45,000. To accompany the launch of the XC40 recharge, Volvo is also revamping its sales process. From early next year, customers visiting its website will be asked first if they want an electrified car and a range of financial incentives designed to encourage efficient electric driving will also be offered. With Volvo aiming for plug-in hybrids to account for a fifth of its total sales next year, the firm is planning to triple production capacity for its electrified models, including the XC40 recharge. It will also offer a new designer's choice selection for recharge models, which, it says, will feature radically reduced delivery times.